when playing rock or jazz or uh, funk, Latin type of beats, a lot of, you know, we're using the snare drum, we're using like the click on the, on the snare or the rim, um, you know, but a lot, the snare is like one of the most uh, used part of the instrument, the bass drum snare and the hi-hat and the toms are usually used for the fills. I'm just going to show you how I integrate the toms or drummers integrate the toms uh, also within a beat, not just for fills, but just using it as a, as a backbeat too, as opposed to using uh, the snare. Uh, a good example if you want to see a drummer that uh, uses a lot of the toms for his uh, backbeats and he uses it with reggae and funk is uh, Stuart Copeland of The Police, the band The Police. He, he'll do things like... uses that upper tom uh, and a lot of his, you know, his reggae beats where... He, that kind of thing. So, but you could use it with rock or jazz, uh, you know, whatever. But it's fun to, to use different tones of the of the toms as a as while well using it as a backbeat or as a groove, and not just as fills. Like, you know, I'll give you some examples. gives it kind of a bass, you know, feel to it. It gives you more tones as just doing, you know. And that's cool too, but sometimes you can throw it in there just for more texture. And uh, <clears throat> with jazz, same thing. Straight up rock or punk? You know, anything. You can do it with polka. That's pretty much polka. So anything you can use the toms. Sometimes you just want to use the toms instead of using the snare. is I'll unlatch the snare, so I take the snare off the snare drum, and use it for a higher pitch tom. Another snare drum to the, over here, and you just took the, the uh, and, and cranked it up a bit and took the snares off it. It's good for reggae, so you're like. something I want to show you. It's kind of cool. I know probably a lot of drummers do that, but I think it's really good to just sometimes just stay off the snare so heavily and just kind of use your rack toms and your floor toms just to give it more flavor. It makes it more fun for the drummer. And I think it sounds better too, especially in jazz. They're always using toms, but you can do it in rock too. Is 
using when you're really driving a beat, have one have use this as a symbol, use your floor tom as a symbol. surf but it just drives the beat <clears throat> surf to, I think surf drummers do that too right? that's a groove surf drumming is like that he's a lot of toms That pretty much shows that and uh, just kind of experiment with uh, with the toms and the more toms you have the more experimentation so this is just your basic five-piece kit you know if you had the octobons and all that kind of like Stuart Copeland you could be or uh, Neil Peart that's about it for today so I'm just gonna go out with a jam Thanks a lot, have a great day and maybe I'll see you tomorrow.